Yao Yao is the first Dendro character in Genshin, was what everyone thought until Mihoyo decided to lock her up in their basement for two years. But now that she's here, I decided to build her two different ways, both of which aren't her intended roles by the way. But before I could do that, I first have to free her from Hoyo's basement. Speaking of free, it's totally free to like and subscribe. It helps a lot and it probably makes Yao Yao happy too. Maybe. I don't know, she's not real. Where do I go to pull? Yao Yao is a Liyue character. I guess we'll go to Liyue. Go to the pharmacy? Wait, why Chi Chi though? Chi Chi and Yao Yao are besties? Is that lore accurate? Okay, sure. Let's go Chi Chi then. Then let's glide down to the pharmacy. Can I even go inside here? Oh, cool. Okay. I guess we'll stay here. Spider Chi Chi. I know you guys might be thinking, but Urge, you could just wait for your free four star selector and get a free Yao Yao. And to that, I would say, yes. Yes, you are absolutely right. That is the wise thing to do. But I want my Yao Yao now now. So that's why we're here. Also, I want to show you guys my history because my pity is pretty far. So surely we're not going to get a five star before we get a Yao Yao. Uh, my last five star was Yaimiko at 45 for the banner. I guess I'm just going to pull on Al Haytham's banner because if I'm going to get a five star, I would at least want it to be a, a new character, I guess. All right, enough stalling. We'll do our first Yao Yao. This is 55, 45 to 55. Early C6 Al Haytham? Uh, hell no. I just need a Yao Yao and we could leave. If I get a Diona though, that would be cool too, because that would be C6 for me. Oh! Okay, we're done. <laughs> Actually lucky. I've been sniping these new 4 stars recently. Faruzan I just got in one pull. Like, I didn't even do a 10 pull, I just did one pull. Okay, cool. <laughs> we're done with that. We could leave. Thank you, Chi Chi. Damn, Yao Yao is actually real. Who would have thought Yao Yao would be real? For two years, everybody thought Yao Yao was a myth, but she's actually here. All right. I guess we'll level her up first, right? She scales with HP, so she's for sure not supposed to be a DPS, but that doesn't matter because we'll make her deal damage anyways. Yao Yao 100k build. I don't think Yao Yao could reach 100k. So uh, we're just gonna try and see how how high a uh, spread Yao Yao could deal. But I, I doubt it's gonna reach 100k. I doubt it's even gonna reach 20k to be honest. Are you gonna buy Ayaka skin? I'll buy the Ayaka skin next stream for the Melt Ayaka. Okay, next we gotta figure out which which ability to level up. I think I'm gonna have to go with her burst. Yeah, let's go with her burst. Though I think I have enough for two level 8 talents. Physical Yao Yao? I don't know about that. If I did a physical Yao Yao, that would be like a Zhao Zhao showcase. Plunging attack. I think I've had enough of the Zhao showcases. Actually, I messed up. I was supposed to not level her up yet for the <laughs> Bloom Showcase, but it's fine. And then for her artifacts, since I want to do a Bloom Showcase first, I don't have the new Bloom set. I just don't have enough, <laughs> enough resin for that. So I'll just give her the artifacts with the most Elemental Mastery that I have. So this is the final build. This one, 77 EM, 77 EM, 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 and EM. Also for the weapon, I only have a level 80 Dragon's Bane, but it's gonna have to do for now. Spread Hyper Carry Yao Yao. We'll do the spread damage per screenshot later. For a Bloom Showcase, I don't think anything really matters except for the EM, right? So right now we have close to a thousand EM. If I had a C6 Diona, she would be better than Sucrose. But for this purpose, Sucrose is just here to boost EM, not swirl anything. Uh, Dendro MC though, Deepwood Memories for the Dendro Shred. Barbara, I just gave her instructors. Uh, her weapon doesn't really matter, I think. We'll just let her hold on to this for now. And then we have have Sucrose. 907 EM right now. She's here for this passive of hers right here. So I just have to hit enemies with her E skill or her burst and she's gonna boost EM. So okay so that's how her <laughs> E skill works. It's Baron Bunny on steroids. So I just did a Sucrose E skill and now my EM is boosted. So that's what Sucrose is here for. As I said earlier, if I had a C6 Diona, this would be way better with her than Sucrose because I could freeze the enemies. I have to apply Hydro first. So Yao Yao would be the one to create the, the Bloom cores. We'll start with MC. 
then we boost DM. We go Barbara. Did that do anything? <laughs> I think Barbara's the one creating the blooms right now. Wait, I saw 22k. 21k. That was 21k. That worked better than I expected, to be honest. I'm gonna try this again, just so we could see the actual damage. Is it dealing that Okay, wait. I don't see the big damage right now. Oh, wait. But the thing is, when I use my Dendro MC Burst, it's actually applying Dendro. So I have to override it with Barbara Hydro. I always have to have Hydro applied on the enemy. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But maybe I'll use Mona instead. Yeah, I think it's better if I use Mona. Uh, yeah, it wasn't better when I used Mona. Bro, what is happening? Those did not look like 20k cores to me. I think Barbara applies Hydro more consistently just because I can control where her Hydro application goes. For Mona, her thing expires after a bit, so... But I want to try this again. One last time with Barbara. Okay. Okay. Constant Pyro appli- I mean Hydro application. There you go, 20k. Yeah, that was 20k consistently. The neat thing about Bloom Reactions too is it doesn't crit, so I don't have to think about crit chances. There's no gotcha in the damage for Bloom. It's just straight up what your stats are. Just pure EM and character level. I don't know how I got 21k earlier, but it's fine. We got the 20k. <gasps> That's Blue Meow Meow for you. So now I want to try the Big Pee Pee Meow Meow, which is basically going to be aggravate damage. For that, I don't think the damage is going to be very high. If I reach 20k, I'd be happy with that. But I've done a couple of Dendro damage per screenshots before. So I think this is the best setup I could do. Basically just Lisa and Bennett with Dendro MC again. Lisa with the Instructor. Thrilling Tales. I think I'm going to have to use Black Cliff Pole just for the crit damage. Yeah, this is the best one I have, but it's still pretty bad. Hopefully it doesn't land on death. Bro, okay. I, I, we can still level this up, the feather. Bro! Okay. Okay, man, okay. I see you, Tank Yao Yao. So these are the pieces right now. Flower, Plume, Sands, Goblet, and the Circlet. They're all pretty bad. Yeah, they're pretty bad. Uh, okay, stats. Stats time. Stats time. Attack, 1.5k. 249 EM, which is probably going to help a bit with the spread reaction. Crit rate, bad. Crit damage, fine. And then Dendro damage bonus, 46.6, the standard. Deathmatch? Wait, deathmatch buffs crit rate though. That's not gonna give us big PP damage. We need the big PP damage here. We're not all about that consistent practical damage. We're here for the goofy damage per screenshot. You're never gonna use in the abyss kind of damage showcase. So I guess we'll just go to level 60 Scaramouche because it's way easier. I don't think I need to level up her burst though. I mean her E skill. Yeah, because this one is just white Jade Radish. This one is the Adepta Legacy White Jade Radish, so I think we're fine here. Yo, is that- wait, she's actually dealing 14k. I mean, the rabbit is. You guys see that? How much damage do you guys think this is gonna deal? I feel like it's gonna deal maybe 20k, just like the bloom damage a while ago. Oh, I can't reach it with that. Can the bunny reach it? Okay, cool. It can. Uh, one more bunny, please. Oh no, okay. I think we ran out of time there. Did you guys know Yayao's JPVA actually voiced a character from Overflow? My favorite anime of all time. Bro, the aim. Come on, please, Bennett. Okay, cool. We got it, right? We cleared it. We, we just need to collect the balls. Uh, okay. Okay, we're here, we're here. Let's eat the crit rate food buff. Yeah, pile them up, pile them up. Oh god, this is so close. Oh no. Oh no. 90... 21k. Okay. There you go. 20... 21k. It's literally the same damage. 
The same damage as the Bloom cores. Is this even on a level 60 boss with reduced resistances? So, <laughs> there you go. DPS Yao Yao, I guess. Yao Yao did her best, but anyways, I think I think Yao Yao's done. We waited for her for two years, but now we're gonna see her in the next two years again, cause she's gonna be hiding in our basements, never to be used. Goodbye.